In August of 2022, Lodge Cast Iron released two specialty pans as a celebration of the international holiday Dia de Muertos, or the Day of the Dead. One was this lovely skillet with a sugar skull design on the other side. The other pan was a skull-shaped cast iron baking pan, which I couldn't resist getting myself to play around with. Even though this is promoted for Dia de Muertos, you know this is going to be seen as more of a Halloween item. Not that there's anything wrong with that. I have to say, this pan was bigger than I was expecting. Ten and three quarter inches. Twelve and a half inches. And the skull is four and a half inches across. That's pretty big. At its widest point, it is about three and three eighths inches across. It's also about one and a quarter inches deep. So yes, these are some pretty big molds. Here we compare the lodge pan to a Birmingham Stoven Range corn stick pan, and as you can see, there's really no comparison. And this is a comparison with a cast iron popover pan, also from BSR. So yes, you can make some pretty big cakes in this skull pan. I'll be the first to admit that I'm really not that great at cake decorating. And so even though Lodge really wants you to make cakes in this pan, I'm going to put it through its paces by doing a couple of more simple recipes that are made especially for cast iron. And that's why we're gonna start out with none other than cornbread. When making cornbread, we treat this pan the same way as a cast iron skillet, and that means placing the pan in the oven and getting both the oven and the pan good and hot before adding our batter. Being a born and bred Yankee at heart, we'll be making some sweet northern cornbread in this skull pan. This will also let us see if something with a lot of sugar sticks to the pan after it bakes. The wet ingredients include buttermilk, an egg, melted butter, and then more milk. It's important to mix in enough milk a little at a time to get the batter to the right consistency. And we mix in honey for some extra sweetness. And now the screaming hot pan comes out of the oven. And then we make sure the pans are completely coated in the oil and heat up the oil in the hot pan for a few minutes. Once everything is good and hot, we mix the extra oil into the batter and then it goes into the pan. And now it goes into the oven to bake until it's done. This usually takes about 30 minutes. This cornbread rolls pretty good in the oven, and the outside is good and brown when it comes out of the oven. We only need to wait for a couple of minutes before running a knife around the edges of the pan. And now comes the flip. and there was really no sticking at all. And here we present some skull cornbread, ready to present to your guests, whether you're celebrating Halloween, Samhain, or even Dia de Muertos. And this is the Lodge Cast Iron Skull Cake Pan. It's definitely a luxury item, since there are only so many reasons to make skull-shaped cakes or cornbread but this is definitely a lot of fun to use, and it's certain to be popular, especially at this time of year. But any time of year is good for cornbread, and if you feel like spending the money and getting one of these, well, you certainly won't regret it. Have fun cooking in this, because like any cast iron pan, it's certain to last the rest of your life. Thank you for watching.